this next name here that I think early on has to be leading the all name team charts at 16 out of, is that, is that Norway or Denmark? He is Not great a, on my flags. He's a, um, he's a Norwegian. Norway. We have another three namer, Michael Bransegg Nygaard. What a fucking name. I love it. Yeah. Oh, and, we, and he's playing in Sweden. So you're going to be all over him this year. <laughs> Well, it's, which is why I said that we had to mention this guy because he's probably the one Swede that's firmly in the first round. Um, he's legit. Big right winger, good shot, real good playmaker. Um, and he, I think the upside's super high with a guy like him. But, like, the big thing that stuck out for me this year is how aggressive he was. But even then, he went, and again, he's playing a lot of games in the all Svenskin, so the same uh, league that, uh, Dvorsky was playing in, and he ended up playing in some playoff games and fitting in more than adequately. Uh, so he's already playing a pretty advanced game just in terms of like being able to like play in hard situations where it's not just he's out there to play junior hockey in Sweden and like put up a million points. Um, and again, like I talked about this with our other triple name guy, uh, Oscar Fisker Bolgard. Not out of Norway. He was out of Denmark that went to Sweden. But uh, this was uh, Bransegg Nygaard's first year in Sweden. Before that, he's playing in Norway, his junior hockey. And he comes over this year to Sweden over a point per game in the J20 on a non-playoff team. Um, again, goes and features in all Svenskin games, puts up a couple points there, plays in playoffs, like fits right in and has kind of just like an overall like approach to the game that I think ultimately translates really well to the North American style too. Part of that's just the uh, aggression um, and just like the, play, the the plays that he makes are, yes, high end, but like the kind that you see in the NHL where I'm not. And again, the dual shot, that helps too. But I just think he's going to ultimately translate really well, just his approach to the game. I think he has the advanced kind of like two-way game too. Um but another guy I'm a big fan of, but the real the big reason I wanted to mention was just the fact that he's like the one Swede for the first time ever that's like firmly in this first round. And I say Swede as in based out of Sweden. So that's one of the I guys that Sweden, I scout. Yeah. One of the guys that I scout. So there you go. <laughs> uh, there's not a whole lot of guys at the moment, even though there's one other guy, great name too, that I think is firmly a first round talent for me. Well, then big, big center. Simone Zether with a Z. Beauty playing for Rogla, beast, unbelievable playmaker, great shot, plays a two way game, physical, mean, love him. Uh, one of my favorites out of Sweden. I think a guy that should go first overall. It helps that he's a big right shot center. I was just gonna ask, is he a midget or is he seven feet? No, he's six foot three, so seven big feet boy. Tall. Yeah, so he's he's a giant, Andre the Giant, same thing. Simone the, the Zether. 40 beers on a plane. Probably. Legend. Legend. I think that's it. I think we did it. That rounded I think out. We did the thing. 